in our fuel culture segment we're flashing back all the way to 2001 for anthony cruz and one of his biggest hits when he covered ushers you got it you got it bad yo big song that i wrote you know so yo make we get the backstory behind the song and of course you know it goes already a fuel culture anthony cruz your turn fuel culture is powered by ray white overproof rum fuel culture yeah man we'll carry you right back to the big big tune that set me off in jamaica you got it, you got it bad When you're on the phone Hang up, then you call right back I get a story The whole story, the full story for that show You know, I miss it though Stay tuned Anthony Cruz Blaze it hot Nobody wants to be alone When you're touched by the words in the song Baby, you got it, you got it bad When you're on the phone Hang up, then you call right back you got it bad. Why did you decide to cover this song? All right. That song was one of the biggest songs in the United States at the time. And um, my stepbrother, I named Talti, called me and said, Yo, you have to do over this song. And I said, Send it come and hear it. And I said, it come. I never really too like it, to be honest. You know? And people were saying, Yo, that song is so pretty, you shall lick it over. I say, all right, so much people are telling me to do it and thing, and I call Finger one day, I say, Finger, my brother mixing Finger, I say, yo, they have a money can lick a rhythm. I say, yeah, man. I say, which song? I say, what song with all T send come give me? I say, pressure me to sing it and thing, you know? And we set up a studio time, Tough Gang studio, call up um, Cableton um, band, and some of the top musicians, them, and we just hold our vibes in the studio. You got it bad when you're stuck in the house You don't wanna have fun All you think about it You got it bad when you're out with someone And you keep on thinking about somebody else When the man them start playing the rhythm And we go ah, ah, nah. The man them pull it up, actually pull up the song Before, them even, before we even finish I say, yo crows, I want a gun <laughs> I remember doing a show with Bujo and Tony Curtis them down in a Lindsay. I don't, I'm not quite sure if it was a year to year show with Bujo. I'm going to come late. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to step up on the stage with that show and the man them call me up. I tell you, I'm going to salute, I never know if I was salute in that one song. <laughs> Girl, I want you to know, I really adore you. All my ladies who got it going on. I remember in Canada, when it went number one in Canada, I legit was the one who called me and said, Yo, that song is gone in a youth, it has mashed up Jamaica and it got just go number one in Canada. I said, What? And that song was just one of my biggest songs. Barry G said, I'm favorite song, I want my favorite reggae song. You know, and that song kind of launched me out in Jamaica, the right way where people can identify somebody with a tune. It's like how you identify um, Bob Marley with One Love. Anthony Cruz, You Got It Bad was the song for me at that time. What was the vibe like in the studio while working <laughs> on the track? Well, you know, so that, 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 that's how you cast an argument between me and finger. Listen to that story, you know. All right, we have two girls at the studio, see? And um, them they're around the board and mixing finger and doing thing. And you know, don't know, big bad producer and everything. And he might tell me if I sing a certain part of the song. A certain way. Me understand, you're the producer and thing. But me know what I want and how to fit it. So I must say, I'm the producer. I say, finger, me don't need to sing it over because I like how it sounds. And I must say, you are him the producer. <laughs> and we start go at each other. You know, we just get up and I say, yo, here we I'm going to have a gun in my yard. You know. And up to this day, we don't sing over the part. But guess what? That song, trust me. You're my girl. The first time I heard my IRF was GT Jump It. But, and then Jump It and then Jump It and then Jump It. And my finger start jump. He said, Yo, the tune gone. And we had jumped like two little boys. I said, We're rich. <laughs> We're rich. When the song took off, um, were you surprised? Were you taken aback when it became a hit locally and overseas? Um, I wasn't really surprised because um, the song, Usher song, was hot at the time. Very, very hot. So you know, usually when you touch them song there, <laughs> and the funny thing, and next piece of story behind that song, the Richie B, 
produced Tony Curtis singing that song. So one day, we're gonna check Richie B and drop off my song. And Mr. Richie B, that tune is gone. You know. If I give you a CD with Tony Curtis, well, look, I see us. <laughs> you know, in Japan, them love cover version. And I went, I went to tour in Japan, um, about probably about 12, 12 or so club. And we get the experience. Um, people singing your music and can't talk English, <laughs> you know. Um, the United States, we toured the 40, oh, 42 states, I think, yes. Um, that song that bring me right over the world, all over the world, before me even get um, halfway through and them songs. That song that came right over the world. Yes, man, set me good, you know. This is Anthony Cruz live and direct, and do remember that. Dance hall and reggae are our culture. See, so keep it clean and keep it positive. Rastafari bless.